Hey guys, and welcome back to Pokemon Stadium. We're in here in the Gem Leader Castle now, so now we're going to continue. Last time we beat the second trainer of the Cerulean Gym, who was an accuracy noob, so it's very good to be past that. Alright, so, uh, Sandman, um, ACDC, and, um, Mr. Norris, I guess, even though he's a little bit useless now. I'm finding out that kind of sad fact now. He's a little bit useless. He was good in the, in uh, red, but in here, he's not exactly... He's not... He's not really holding up. Oh, well. Gotta do with what you gotta do. Oh! Mankmer. Okay. Man, don't use Seismic Toss. That actually does a substantial amount of damage, man. Alright, well, fine. Because everything else on my team actually has relatively high stats. I mean, Rhydon has an insane attack. Charizard is very, very good, you know, with Flamethrower and stuff like that. I think it's just because of his moveset, really. I mean, he doesn't really have a very good moveset. All he has is, um, you know, a fighting move and two normal moves and a leer. I mean, he doesn't really even have Toxic or anything like that, so he's not all that useful anymore. It, it kind of sucks to say that, but I gotta admit it. I mean, he was pretty good in the game. I mean, he helped me through a lot of bad places, but... Oh well, I guess he's just not that useful anymore. Oh, well, it doesn't really matter. Oh my... Oh man, I remember how they did those attacks in this game. It's so much nicer than they did in the handheld. I mean, did you see how short that attack went and normally how long those ones take? Man, I'm glad that they changed it that way. And Nightmer. I'm a Nightmer. That's so weird. I wonder... What? Is it Mer as in like mermaid or something? I don't get it. A fairy Mer. Hey, Clefairy says is over, and I won. I don't even... Jeez, get the frick out of Hypno's face. I don't want to see that nose up that close. Now I know why they made him a pedophile, because of that freaking nose. Doesn't it? His nose alone screams pedophile. Ugh. Okay. And Psywave. Hey, look, the move that let me stay alive in the freaking uh, Saffron Gym. Okay. So that didn't do anything. And of course, it doesn't have any other... Um, it doesn't have any other effects, so it really is just a really terrible move. Ugh, but okay, that's fine. Uh, no, yes, it is. Its HP is at zero. That means that it is, in fact, down and out. Alright, not too bad. Kaboom! All right, continue on to Misty, and hopefully she'll be as easy as Brock. The only problem with these gym leaders, really, is that sometimes... Oh, dang, she's got a Blastoise. Okay, and she's got her Starmie and Staryu, so that's cool. I like how they keep the, her original team intact. That's pretty sweet, actually. Um, the only problem with these leaders sometimes is that they don't have Pokemon that you'd expect. Like... You expect them to have nothing but water types, but sometimes they'll throw f throw you for a loop and they'll have something else. Kind of like how um, Brock had, you know, Omanyte and Kabuto. That kind of threw me for a bit because it's like, oh crap, well he's got a rock type. I can't really just use Surf against it. I mean, I would have had no problem taking it out, but still. As you get into the tougher gems, they're going to throw in weirder stuff, and that weird stuff could actually spell your doom. But, okay. Yes, it was. Okay. It's good to be in a gym battle already, though. I like... It, it, I don't like taking my time before this and knowing that it's like, oh, well, we've got, like, three minutes of useless video before we actually get to the good stuff. Because then I can accurate... I can really accurately judge my, um... You know, my progress by knowing where I started in terms of, you know, content and stuff. Because in the last video, I know that I got a gym and a half in... And I still had a little bit of time where I, you know, actually went to the castle, I registered my team, and then all that stuff. Um, okay, Thunderbolt, and crap, Thunder Wave. I know, I was like super late reaction, but whatever. Just please don't get paralyzed. I don't want to be paralyzed. Okay. Well, I mean, you know, fully paralyzed. Okay, good. Thank you. 
All right, now just one left, because I don't want to be down to 2-2 two, two versus uh, Misty, especially when her Starmie's packing Thunder Wave. All right. And of course, I could always just Thunder Wave her last, which I'm assuming is going to be Blastoise. I'm just assuming there. Uh, yep, Blastoise. And it's like, oh, check on my cannons. And it's check out these guns. <laughs> Get it? Because it's an actual gun. All right. Uh, Skull Bash. Oh, it's... It's digging? Oh, crap. Um, that's actually not good. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna miss. All right. Crap, I could actually go down here. Um... Uh, dang, I don't know what I want to do. I guess I'll just try for a Thunderbolt, see if I survive the dig. I'm betting that I'm not going to, but let's see. Maybe I will, who knows. Come on, yeah, go, ACDC. Oh, come on! Oh, I should have gone for Thunder Wave. I should have, but oh well. Watch, it's going to dig again. Oh. Yeah, yeah, the underground attack continues, and it's going to kill me this time. Oh, now you move! Oh, I'm not going to swap out because I don't feel like taking damage with anything else, so I'll just let ACDC bite the dust here. There's not much point letting him live, because at, like, if I just send him out later, then he'd just dig and get me, so there's not much point. Yeah, after a good fight, if only it could have actually hit the freaking turtle. Um... I'll go with Mr. Norris, just because I want to get some damage on there for, what's his name, uh, Sandman. But okay, you see what I mean, how they can have weird things? I did, really did not expect this Blastoise to have Dig. Of course, it's a good move on her part, but that little unknown, that kind of got me. And wow, that did not do much. Okay, Hydro Pump. Boom! Of course, it, Hydro Pump looks freaking awesome in this game. Well, I mean, when Blastoise uses it, but, you know. It looks, you know, it looks the same for everybody else. It likes just, like, one little pump of water comes out for every other water type that uses it. But when Blastoise uses it, it actually physically comes out of both cannons, which is awesome. Oh, come on, you can't miss? Oh. Man, I lost to my paralysis, and you don't lose to your accuracy? Fine. Maybe I should have been an accuracy noob like the freaking halfway point trainer. Oh. All right, Sam, man, it's up to you. Don't you dare, like, suck. I swear if he uses Dig, I'm going to be pissed. Okay. Okay, and I have the special to take it. Oh, okay, he's going to go for Seismic Toss. Okay. I didn't know that this could learn Seismic Toss, but okay. My Psychic will hopefully be powerful enough to take it out, and, you know, when I need to take it out. Okay, special fell. Good. Oh, all right, well, just one more hit. All right, come on. Size okay, good. I got this in the bag now. Sweet. As long as this doesn't cause flinching, ugh, it better not. Okay, good. It's like if that thing, like, paralyzes me or, like, puts me to sleep because I forgot some stupid mechanic in the first generation, I'm going to be mad. <laughs> That'd be, like, the stupidest freaking gym leader challenge ever. I die at the freaking... At, at Misty. Oh. But, okay. Yeah, screw you, Misty, and your stupid freaking Blastoise with Dig. Oh. Alright. Next gym. I don't care. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Surge's Tower. Okay. Let's do it. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't select from the game. I don't want to use... I'll just, you know, select from the registered set. Thank you. Let's do it. There we go. Okay, so, uh, Rambi should be very useful here. Uh, see, look at that. You see, they're supposed to have electric types, but no. They got things that are weak to electric types, which is freaking stupid. Uh, actually, every single thing on his team can be totally destroyed by, what's it called? Um, you know, uh, ACDC. Every single thing. That's why Electabuzz is really great. He's just got great type coverage. I mean, I, Psychic and Thunderbolt, it really does cover a lot of types. And then there's Submission to deal with Rock and Ground types. So, I mean, he's just a great Pokemon. Stats aren't perfect, but, you know. And, yeah, yeah, come on, die, please. 
Yep, down already. This is kind of boring in these opening fights because they're all so easy. But hey, it's all progress, right? So, yeah, poke lore. What, lore? I don't... A lot of the nicknames in this game are freaking stupid. It's just like throwing on an extra word and just taking off a little bit of one, like the actual names. It's it's weird. All right, there we go. And you're so excited, so excited. And you know, why do they have these? Why do they have the battles on these like suspended platforms? I mean, we're hovering above a giant pit. The only thing we're supported by is four chains. You'd think those chains would break if they, like, used... Like, if a Pokemon used Earthquake, we'd fall into the pit and die. I mean, what what's the purpose of that? And what if you... What if one of the trainers misses the platform with his Pokeball and they accidentally throw their Pokemon down in the pit? I mean, you know, they're throwing the Pokeballs out onto the platform. So what if someone just has a really, really weak throwing arm and they don't make it onto the platform. That would be so stupid. It'd probably be really funny, too. It's like, you win by default. The other trainer is so stupid he can't get his platform on the thing. I mean, his thing on the platform. Okay, so Rambi time, uh, time finally. Um, Buzz Ace. Uh, I'll bring out Ifrit, even though I know that's really dangerous. I'm going to try it. I mean, all of his Pokemon are freaking uh, ground types. I mean, uh, electric types, aside from what's it called? Porygon. So, I don't really have much to worry about. But, you know, there's always that chance. Oh, takedown? Oh, no, you did 10 damage to me. Oh, wait, no. How much did you... Wait. No, he did, like, 16, I think. I'm bad at math. <laughs> I should be able to get it right off the bat, because that's a small number. It's once... Whatever. I don't care. I'm not a math wizard. I'm not even a math, like, apprentice. Or math novice. I don't know. All right, so. Uh, Pori Ace. This is the one I'm worried about, because Porygon usually packs Ice Beam. So. But hey, I got his Electabuzz. I mean, uh, his Electrode out, so... Um, maybe I'll be able to get through this. Uh, oh wow, I'm actually faster. Okay, I'll take that. Yeah, good old freaking um, speed boost. You know, Carbos. Alright, what do you got? Okay, Psybeam. Okay, I didn't expect that, but let's see if I can take it. And Psybeam looks great in this game. It just looks so cool. Okay. Hope my capture card can handle it. I mean, I know the game itself is slowing down, so I hope they didn't, like, lag the capture card or anything. That's some crazy effects. Alright, so, you're dead. Come on, give me another electric type. Oh, well, you only have another electric type, so... Uh, I'm guessing Electabuzz. I'm just guessing. Let's see. Can I guess? Yeah, I got it. My Electabuzz is better. Why is yours slightly green? Is it because I already have one? That's actually kind of weird. I wonder why they did that. I mean, it's not like... You taught it Psywave? It can learn Psychic! You moron! <laughs> oh, man. Whatever. And it can also learn Submission, just so you know. I mean, you could have done a, at least a little bit of damage to Rampy. If you got a critical hit, you might have actually gotten me close to death. But no, okay, I, I guess not. Anyway. Ugh. Um, 13 minutes. No, 14 minutes. I don't know. Should we keep going? No, nah, I think I'll end it off here just because. Because I can. All right, so next time on, um, you know, the Gym Leader Castle, we're going to hopefully beat Lieutenant Surge and continue into the Grass Gym. So see you guys then.